Hi everybody, I'm Jody Cordell, so, and I just want to say welcome to my humble abode. We're in my backyard today and I'm super excited. I am here to, I got my Naked Wines delivery today. today. Woohoo! So I'm always excited whenever I get a new box. Um, and Naked Wines is, uh, I get to be an angel investor in wineries, which is super, super cool. If you haven't heard anything about Naked Wines yet, there's a couple of different other ones that you can be part of and um, I'll leave a link underneath this video so you can go check it out. It's pretty cool. Uh, I get some free wines um, each month with my order whenever I decide to order. It's kind of a cool gig um, and I just got a new box today. So today I'm super excited about this. Look at that. Isn't that a beautiful label? Look at that. Rock it like a redhead. I think I know a little something about how to rock it like a redhead. What do you think? So, um, and this is a blend. This is the, the red 2019. So I'm super excited. I already got a little bit in my glass over here to uh, check it out. I've been letting it kind of sit and breathe for a little bit. Um, right now I want to kind of look on the website and kind of see what it says. Okay, so about this particular wine. It's a classic refined Aussie combo of Cab and Shiraz crafted with Jen's signature finesse. And that would be Jen Pfeiffer here, um, who's the winemaker. The Rebel Red is packed with the perfect layering of lush, dark berry flavors mingled with an elegant, velvety smoothness from six months of aging in French oak. Woo, that sounds awesome. I love wood. <laughs> okay, so without further ado, do you guys mind? Do you mind? Dogs, oh my gosh, what are you going to do with them? So anyway, without further ado, this is Jen Pfeiffer's the rebel red woohoo it smells like dark fruit and wood it's kind of cool oh that is lovely it's super like velvety in your mouth wow what a cool mouthfeel uh. yeah I can taste that hint of that Shiraz in there. That little spice that, that makes Shiraz taste the way it does. Oh, that's lovely. Oh yeah, that's that's gonna be a favorite, I think. Yummy. Oh my goodness, yes! So, okay, so, and I got two uh, Jen Pfeiffer bottles um, in my uh, box. So the other one is actually a cab. So I'm gonna save that one, I don't wanna, do them back to back so I'll do a different one the next time so anyways yeah that's a really tasty lovely wine um and I guess it's a it's not the traditional blends that I usually drink I usually drink the California blends which uh are really fruity um this one is a little bit uh fuller bodied than like the ones that I like to drink all the time the ones I drink most of the time. Okay, let me just be honest. Uh, I, I drink a lot of Barefoot and I drink a lot of the Apothic. Oh my gosh, I really like the Apothic. It's so good to me. But, and, and of course, my whole thing is I do not pay more than $25 for a bottle of wine because, no, I'm not collecting. I'm, I'm going to drink it. So if I'm going to drink it, I'm probably not going to spend more than $25 on the bottle. <laughs> But that's just me and my personal thing. There's a, a whole reason for that. That's a whole other video and a whole other blog post. If you're looking for a decent wine, now here's the cool thing. This bottle right here on the website, if you're not a, an angel investor, it's like $21 for this bottle right here. And if you are an angel investor, it's only $10. What? Woohoo! And um, let's see here. Jen Pfeiffer Wines are special collaboration made with NakedWines.com, which is awesome. So some of their wines you can't get anywhere but through the Naked Wines, which is kind of a cool thing. Oh, this is what she says. These wines express, express the connection between my fiery, passionate personality, I think I like her already, and my commitment to my craft, rock it like a redhead. Oh, that's so awesome. The Rebel Range are spirited wines with a good dose of attitude. Cheers, Jen Pfeiffer. That's so lovely. I think she's gonna be my friend. <laughs> I might need to reach out to her and ask her for an interview and just see if we can't get some of that fiery passion and personality to come out in an interview like this. I think that would be really cool. In fact, it'd be even better if it were on a video 
a video interview. Wouldn't that be awesome? So that's it for me today. I'm going to go back and drink some more of Jen's lovely, delicious, velvety red wine. It is wine down Wednesday. So I'm going to sit here on the patio and enjoy this lovely fall weather and have some more of this lovely wine. And I will see you on the next video.